the Supreme Court ruled that an income tax was actually unconstitutional. The reasoning coming from Article 1, Section 9, quote, no capitation or other direct tax shall be laid unless in proportion to the census or enumeration herein before directed to be taken. So by understanding it as a direct tax, any income tax would have to be implemented in proportion to population across the states, which wouldn't even make any sense. The Democrats did not take this decision well. In fact, they even added the policy to their party platform. For nearly 20 years, the Democrats rallied support for an income tax so finally, in 1913, they were able to ratify the 16th Amendment, which said, I'll allow it. Newly elected President Woodrow Wilson then wasted no time in getting something on the books. The very same year, Congress expanded the Commissioner of Internal Revenue into the Bureau of Internal Revenue, later renamed the Internal Revenue Service. 